welcome back to our YouTube channel and today we are heading up to Aviemore. We're going there for the weekend to meet up with Iona Adventuring and I think about 50 other people to do a hike around Aviemore. It's going to be huge. So we're really looking forward to it and we've packed all our winter woolies and preparing for some snow I think. Bear in mind we've been spending the past two months in Europe where it's been at least 20 degrees so that's it's not going to be fun. Well, it's going to be fun, but it's going to be freezing cold. <laughs> it's going to be a shock to the system, I think. But at least we're staying in a caravan and not in a tent. So that was our first stop on the way up to Aviemore. It was uh, Aria, which is the mermaid overlooking Cumbernauld, uh, sitting right in the graveyard. It's how long? How tall is it? It's Ten meters. Ten meters, seven tons, and uh, yeah, it's quite a nice sight. Right, our next stop, we're going to the Kelpies, which is the famous two horse heads. You've probably seen them in Glasgow or in Scotland, and um, they are basically Scottish mythology creatures. They hang around the water, and they take forms of different animals. These famously horses in particular, but yeah, they're really cool. So the final stop we're making on the trip north is at the Falkirk Wheel, sitting just behind me just here. Now this is used as a canal boat to kind of uh, transfer it, takes it from a high down to a low. And uh, between the many canals that are sitting around Falkirk, it's very cool. I rode it when I was a kid. Uh, I'm just waiting here in the freezing cold we're in the physical. Sean and Costa were looking outside the window and the weather has changed honestly about 16 times in the past half hour between rain, snow, wind, sunshine, it's had all, all four seasons in one day. Um, if you ever go to any of the sort of bigger chains in the UK then make sure you bring your own cup with you, you'll save 25p which is a bargain and also if instead of getting a takeaway cup you're protected with the environment. Yeah exactly. So, I don't, know why, we, I don't know why you wouldn't bring your own cup, it's ridiculous. We normally bring our tea cups with us. Now, I actually forgot to bring my tea cup to Aviemore and I seem to have lost the lid when I was travelling as well, which is a bit of a pain. But I brought a mug out of the caravan and I still saved 25p. So 25p? Come on. If you've got a mug, just bring it with you. You save 25p exactly. and protect the environment. Yeah, as I said, four seasons in one day. We're now back at the caravan, gonna get some quick lunch, but this is our home for the next few days. I'll give you a quick tour of it. It's actually, it was glorious about 10 minutes ago and now we're out and it's pouring again. But we're heading down to Loch Morlock anyway, just for like a wonder. Um, and yeah, just out and about. Show sure you guys see. our favourite spot in Aviemore, right down by Loch Morlock, right in the banks. Beautiful. So yeah, we we're going to bring our swimming stuff, but I conveniently forgot mine. How is it, Jim? Are you going in for a swim? It's not as bad as I thought. So we're up towards the uh, ski slopes now. We're at our next stop. It's a stunning view over Loch Morlach. And uh, yeah, we absolutely love coming up here. We're up here in the summer, flying a drone about. Uh, is, we drove into the snow, actually it's snowing mm. up here now, but check this view out.
All right, so we are frozen from exploring around on the house. We're going to go to our favourite little pub just down from the caravans called uh, the Old Bridge Inn. And um, it was flooded recently, but they've run it up and it is the coziest place we've ever been to. It's gorgeous. <laughs> Alright, so we are on the hill now and uh, it's been about half an hour into it, absolutely boiling already, I can't believe it, but it is so beautiful, like I've never, I uh, can't remember the last time I went hiking when it was this snowy, it's gorgeous. Just on our way down and uh, about probably about 200 people running up the hill that we just came down we were complaining <laughs> about how difficult it oh. is so many fit people out there yeah. you can see them just in the background all the way up that hill just there up into the clouds in the snow and uh talk about weekend inspiration Bad. mountain range we love it up here and today the sun is shining i've got campbell sunglasses on because i can't see it's so bright and yeah have a little look at this <laughs> Stay tuned.